here I am coming back in the, my neighborhood in the afternoon and uh, we have this uh, bus stop right in front of me and what you're going to see right now I'm going to show a video of the back where you're going to see a uh, Penske truck rental van pull right behind me and that's going to be the suspicious vehicle that's going to be uh, stalking me coming back in my neighborhood Okay, in a few seconds you're going to see the suspicious vehicle pull up behind me I didn't think anything of it at first um, but then I asked myself a couple of questions once the vehicle pulled right behind me uh, one of the questions I asked myself was one uh, there are approximately six blocks in my neighborhood It's very quiet hardly any cars there I figure if this vehicle follows me into my street the one that I live in and if it followed me there it needs to have a purpose being on the block where I live in so I waited to see if this vehicle actually had a purpose and here is the Penske rental vehicle I didn't think anything of it at first but then I asked myself a couple of questions there are six blocks if it follows me on my street it increases the chance that it's a gang stalker and two it needs to have a purpose there if it stops for any purpose on my on that block where I live in it needs to do something with the vehicle not just idle around and we're gonna see that in fact that's what this vehicle does it idles around on my very block and you're gonna see the vehicle follow me in a few seconds and what the gang stalkers they try to do is they try to make you uncomfortable going in your own neighborhood by following you all the way up to your house to where you live and you have to understand right now we had recently moved from our previous place and we were hoping that the gang stalking would stop and it did stop for three weeks but again the last three days I've been brighted sensitized I had street theater done on me I've had uh, a lot of weird incidences again occurring and the people that are being gang stalked it's almost like a sixth sense where they already know where when they're being gang stalked again so in a few seconds this vehicle we're just waiting for that bus to uh, let us pass because it has a stop sign and here if you pass these stop signs they give you a ticket and here you see another vehicle there but that vehicle uh, just uh, goes off into the distance um, and uh, you do get a ticket if you pass these buses with the stop sign they actually have cameras there where uh, they will give you a ticket and here we go so the bus in front of us lets us pass and you see the vehicle there right behind me and it's going to follow me onto the block that I live in. So here I am pulling inside the street where I live in, and the Penske truck follows me onto that block. I put it in slow motion so you could see a few things. And this vehicle, again, it follows me on that one block where I live in out of six. It needs to have a purpose there. And we're going to find out that it has no purpose, it idles. It's going to pull over three houses down from where I live and it's going to turn off its lights and that's why I put it in slow motion so you could see the vehicle turn off its lights and when I pull in my driveway it will turn them back on so look very closely it's gonna he's going to turn off its lights she there you go lights are off and I pull in my driveway he will turn them back on there lights are back on so now I know that this guy just wanted to pretend like he's doing something by turning off his lights like he has some purpose I'm gonna go back over there and find out what's going on with this van so I drop off my kids and I'm going to find out what this Penske van is doing and here we go so I'm going over there and this Penske van as soon as it sees me it tries to leave it tries to leave and I pull right in front of it and I'm grabbing its license plate now you, this vehicle could go to the right and it could go around me but it knows I'm writing its license plate and it's going to pull back it's pulling back because I'm writing down the license plate he doesn't want me to see the license plate he already knows he's idling he's gang stalking 
So then I just pull to the side and I already have the license plate. Now this Penske van just leaves, leaves completely off the block without any purpose whatsoever. He never got out the vehicle. He never did anything. He just parked. All he wanted to do was make me uncomfortable by having a vehicle behind me at all times coming back in my neighborhood. And that's what they do. The gang stalkers, they always want to have one vehicle or two or three behind you at all times when you're coming inside your neighborhood. And it's even weirder if you live in a neighborhood like where I live in, where it's very, very quiet. You hardly have any cars. So that makes it even more obvious of their intentions. Thank you for watching this video. See you guys next time.